am Brittany Akudo and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, this is really, really awkward. <laughs> really awkward for me, I'm not even gonna hold you. This is awkward, just a little bit, it's really awkward. Um, and honestly, it's because this wasn't my idea. Like I didn't want to do this. This was actually God's idea for me. Let me explain. Cause some of y'all are like, what? <laughs> Let me, ex I'll explain. So this, let's take it back to 2020. We know what happened during 2020. I was um, here in my place and I was talking to myself. If you live on your own or like if you live on your own you you know you be having conversations with yourself and it's not even in a crazy way it's just you talk to yourself you know and so i think what was i did i think i was maybe um putting on makeup or something like that and um i learned how to do makeup through youtube so sometimes when i put makeup i act like i'm doing a <laughs> It's so stupid, but I act like I'm doing a YouTube tutorial and that's just how I get through putting my makeup. And so I was talking to myself. I felt God in my heart. God was like, why don't you just make a YouTube channel? And I was like, um, no, <laughs> no, thank you. I don't, I don't think that's for me. Like, no, no thanks. And he was, and he was just like, I just felt him tugging my heart to just, you know, make a YouTube channel. And, you know, me, I'm just not like, like there people do YouTube and they do a great job at it. I just don't think I, that's just my niche. You know what I'm saying? And so I was um, playing tug of war a bit with it, with <laughs> God. And um, I was like, okay, fine. If you want me to start up a YouTube channel, then you're gonna have to provide the camera and the setup. Like, you're gonna have to provide all, it has to be a professional camera, and I don't wanna buy it. And so, girl, look at me trying to challenge God, come on. <laughs> and so God is like, okay. And I'm like, what did I just put myself into? What did I just ask for? And so, yeah, I was like, yeah, I want a professional camera because I don't want to embarrass the kingdom with my iPhone 8. <laughs> so, you know, we want, we want superb quality. And so God, two years later, God provided me with a professional camera and a whole, I mean, you can't see it, but it's like a setup, you know? And so um, the camera, my, my uncle actually purchased it for me. My uncle, he had to, shout out to him. And my uh, ring light, my mother bought me one ring light and the other ring light, my sister bought that for me. And I have a white backdrop, I'm not using it in this video, but my sister bought that for me too. And um, I have a microphone that I'm not using right now. Mother bought that for me. So I have a whole just like setup that I did not purchase, like I didn't spend jack diddly squat on nothing. And so that was two years ago and two years later, here we are. And so, you know, I thank God for that. Now here's here's the real question. Okay, you know, I'll make a YouTube channel, whatever. Um, sorry if I keep, I'm just trying to make sure like, I'm looking over here, I don't know if y'all can tell, but I'm looking over here because it's a monitor, I'm trying to make sure everything is just in tact but anyway so yeah so the real question is okay you got this youtube channel great but what are you gonna talk about like okay you got a youtube channel but what's tea like what what are the like what are the people what do the girls want to hear you know and so it took me months honestly y'all it took me months to figure out what exactly it was that I wanted to talk about, what exactly like the type of content I wanted to put out. And I went through a whole mental list. So first I was like, okay, you know what? I'm a young black engineer. 
So let me put out engineering content, you know, for my ladies, like my woman engineers, and you know, inspire the you young generation of women to go into male dominated fields and all of that. I was like, yeah, let me do that. That might be interesting, but I was like, mm, no, <laughs> honestly, like, honestly, let's, like, let's be real. Y'all don't care. Let's be real. Like, honestly, when it comes to engineering talk, I talked about engineering stuff with my engineering friends because they get it. You know what I mean? But um, I don't think that the engineering content that I would have put out would be interesting, honestly. So I was like, oh, okay, X, not that. I won't talk about that. And then I was like, oh, you know what? I am a full-time student. I go to school full-time. And then I also work full-time as an engineer. How about I talk about how I just balance the two? You know, maybe do like vlogs and stuff. But I was like, mm, I, uh, yeah, I'm not about to do vlogs. Like, honestly, my vlogs would be boring because <laughs> my life is, uh, I'm not doing anything that's just popping all the time, to be honest with y'all. Um, so I was like, no. And honestly, that would be like one day worth of content. Like how I balance the two. In fact, not even one day worth of content. I can tell you right now, this is what I do. Honestly, I just wake up early and I have good time management skills and I try not to procrastinate and I've cultivated myself to be disciplined so that I can get what I need to get done. Boom, that's it, boom, there goes that content. So can't talk about that. Um, so I was like, okay, so hmm, what else can I talk about? And I was like, okay, maybe I can talk about my natural hair, like my natural hair journey. I am natural, fully natural. I did a big chop in 2013 and um, been natural ever since. And I'm like, okay, maybe, you know, people would want to like know, you know, I think it'll be kind of interesting. People want to know like what I do to my hair on a daily and stuff like that and how I grew it out and all of that. But honestly, I don't do much to my hair. Like, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Like, I, I, okay, I have my real hair out right now. I do have a few clippings in the back just to kind of shape it. Because if I didn't, it will just be all over the place or whatever. But I do have a few clippings in the back just to kind of, yeah. But majority of this is my natural hair. And I could go, you know, take y'all on the natural hair journey with me. But to be honest with you, it's not much of a journey. Most of the time, I have protective styling all my hair to be honest with you like in the next few days i'm probably gonna braid it up and like do crochet or something like that so probably not probably not not that so i was like okay dang so what can i make content about and then it dawned on me and i was like <laughs> Brittany, you are tripping I can make content about my clothes. And not just the clothes I buy online or at the store or whatever. I can make content about the clothes that I make because I make clothes. I sew, I like to sew, I like to um, make things from scratch. I like to sketch and all of that. So I was like, <laughs> why did this take me months to figure out <laughs> what to do when I can just easily do that, you know? And so that's what my content is gonna be about, guys. That I'm gonna showcase the stuff I make, but in an interesting way, okay? Like the way I'm gonna, you know, showcase my stuff, you're gonna realize that this is the content that you didn't even know you needed. And speaking of clothes, I actually made this top that you see I have on. I actually, oh, why is my pants so high? Girl, y'all didn't tell me. <laughs> it's so high, but no, I actually made this glove top. Um, it's really cute to me. It's kind of giving um, superhero. <laughs> it's giving very much Marvel, um, but it's cute to me, I like it. And I actually have um, some leftover uh, fabric of this. I don't know if you can see the fabric on the camera. It's kind of like a, wet silk but it's not wet but it's soft it's really good but i have some leftover fabric and um 
when I bought this at the store, um, the cashier was like, oh, this is this fabric's different. What are you gonna make with it? And I was like, oh, I'm gonna make a top. And she was like, oh, this will be really cute with this, like as a set. And I was like, dang, she's right. This would be cute as a set. So I haven't made the bottoms to it, but maybe you guys can let me know what type of bottoms you think with this this would be cute with. So whether it will be cute with a skirt or pants or you know a specific type of pants, like let me know and I'll make it and I'll showcase it in one of the next videos later on. But yeah, so I'll my content will be about clothes. I don't want to start rambling. Like I've already said that girl <laughs> give me some grace look I, this is my first video give me some grace i'm not trying to ramble but yeah um so yeah um let me know what kind of pants you think would be cute with this right now i just have on some regular pants nothing really nothing i mean it's, it's cute it's cute and simple with it but um i would prefer some pants that have this fabric so yeah let me know so yeah, y'all, that's honestly all I have. Again, I don't want to ramble because let's be real. If I start rambling on here for 20 minutes, y'all not going to watch. Y'all going to click off. So um, that's all I have for y'all. Um, if y'all are watching this in the morning, afternoon, evening, whenever you're watching this, I hope you have a great rest of your morning, a great rest of your afternoon, or a great rest of your evening. And I'll see y'all later. Be encouraged. Bye.